salute, salute, salute. I am CEO 5000. Today is my birthday, October 17th. Shouts out to all the Libras and all the people who support me and what I got going on. Thank you for all your support. I almost got my 1,000, my, my 1K on YouTube, and we're going to get better. But this is the P. Diddy Chronicles. Let's go. Diggy, things are looking shaky, baby. Watch this. Well, let me tell you something. I was today years old when I found out Biggie, Big Biggie, Fat Black and Ugly Biggie had a little sugar in his tank. Diddy had Biggie on that baby on my up shit too. I was just listening to some Biggie this morning. Work it out. Get my little jumping jack push up, pull up on, right? And he said a line in a song that was sweeter than a Georgia peach. Biggie said, when I met you, I admit my first thought was the trick. You look, look so, so good, good. Uh, I suck on your daddy. Mushroom tip. What? That's what Biggie said. Then I went a little further in my investigation and realized that Biggie DJ was Mr. C. After Biggie died, Mr. C kept getting caught in the back seat of his car with a chick with a mushroom tip. Now rest in peace to goddamn Mr. C though, cause he died too. But then I said to myself, maybe that's just coincidental. So I started looking into Biggie a little further. And I went and watched all his videos from Juicy Fruit. I went and watched all them videos he had, the all his hit songs from One More Chance. And I realized that Biggie Ben came out the closet. He had the chicks with the mushroom tip in all his videos. Check this shit out! Next question is, you saved me. Love you. I don't think people realize like how young we were, you know. So we're actually like kids in this multi-billion-dollar industry. You know, two young men that really had a chemistry, really got along, and were just really enjoying. My whole childhood is in shambles behind this. Shit. And I blame Diddy. Y'all need to keep Diddy haters, man. He was the one who approved them videos and them songs that got them bigger release with that suspect. She probably was in the, yeah, take that. Take that, take that, take that. He meant that shit. Because you see what's going on with Diddy now? When he said, take that, take that, he meant that. Y'all thought he was playing, take that, take that. He wasn't talking, you take that, take that. And he was talking about, huh? Rick Ross. He was the one that had Biggie on some dark skin Salsa Santana shit. And now that Biggie gone, his legacy is questionable because it appears that Biggie was a gangster rapper, a big gangster rapper with a little bit of sugar in his tank. Okay? Y'all check into that, man. I'm talking about for real. I ain't making this up. Y'all think I'm going to talk about Biggie? Biggie on the last and that Tupac and Biggie. What I'm going to find out about Tupac now? I'm going to go research Tupac. This shit getting scary. Y'all comment below if y'all have seen some suspicious shit on Tupac. Cause I'm scared now, man. All my childhood hero, all we got left is Scarface, Master P, and a couple others, man, that ain't did no goddamn shit. But y'all comment below. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this situation. Biggie. 
big head. Yeah. Y'all like this video. Y'all make sure y'all share this video, baby. We the big 